Hi everybody, I'm Frank from Frank's 3D Shop and today let's look at what I've printed this week on the cheapest Amazon 3D printer all assembled in one. Let's take a look. Oh, the cat. Hello cat. Hello. Don't play with my toys. <laughs> Another thing you can do with, with this little printer is print cat toys. Why not? Let's take a look. Okay, everything on the table is what I've printed this week. One of the cool things that is really useless because it doesn't do anything useful, but it does show people all how a gearbox works. So you have a gearbox here, a working gearbox. Nice. And since uh, Christmas is coming, I have a small kit, a Fantro truck done by Jury Pranjik, a couple of uh, toy robots to be assembled with instruction for the kids, also by uh, Jury Pranjik. Here we, you have a small Dalek from Doctor Who that my wife was asking for. And this one to be printed well because there is many overhang. What I did is I've cut the model in half. If you see here, let's, there's a line here that goes. Uh, so it was printed, printed flat like this and the other side like that and then glued to, together. So that makes for a, you know, a small thing to put on the Christmas tree. Also from Jury Project is a small arcade that you can hang also on the tree some decoration for the tree so i have a, a cool one here and the finish is really good that little printer is really good for small details and a couple of gnomes this was printed without support so you see here you know, we could clean it a bit but uh, with no support that's that's pretty nice and then also with without supports is this little ship. It's really nice. It's still, it's a kind of a steampunk theme. So this one has a problem. If you see here, there's a gap. There's gaps everywhere. So the model is not fully closed. But what I did, and uh, I'm, I'm going to print it. What I did is, is I, I've gone to Microsoft uh, 3D Repair Tool, uh, online repair tool, and it fixed all of those gaps. So I'm going to reprint this because there is gaps even here. So that's not really, yeah, can break easily. Here I have a, I have a small gnome to be assembled. And you have a choice of two feet, of two shoes. And this is for a friend of mine, which has a company doing science experiment in the classes. And they wanted to have a, a model to show the hearth moving at, its, at the right angle. And there is a moon that's going to be included in this to um, make some experiments with the um, eclipse yeah so that's that was a nice project and this this part is printed on the small monoprice mini it's it looked really nice it's a really nice finish with ma's 3d pla white pla so i think that uh for this small printer it's a it's a good uh it's a good show that it can do many things and uh, if you print uh, a lot it's no problem and you can make you can make some gifts for the small kids and even the bigger one maybe some 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 adults would, would like to have this small or an, a bigger one so that's it for me guys hope you like this little video and uh, as usual please comment below give me a thumbs up if you like this video maybe push the little bell 
if you want to be notified uh, when I do a new video. And see you in the next video. Ciao!